Thomas? Is that you? Have you come to help me? Sorry, Diesel, but I'm far too busy. It's nearly morning and I have lots of jobs to do. Today is the Earl's grand Christmas lunch. Thomas? Are you sure about this, Thomas? Yes. Pile it on with... <laughs> I can't tell it's you. Perfect. That's the idea. <laughs> What's that? That smell? Christmas future! Oh no! This is the worst Christmas ever! If you think this is the worst Christmas, let me tell you what your future Christmases will be like if you don't start helping others. Others will stop helping you, and you'll be left alone! Meanwhile, up at the castle, the Earl was getting ready for all the guests to arrive. Ho oh, ho! Merry Christmas, Percy! Presents over there, please! <laughs> the choir is here! Marvellous! La 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 la! Oh, and the food for the lunch! Where are all the guests? Thomas? Uh, have you come to help? Yes, Diesel, of course I have. I couldn't just abandon an engine who had come off the track. Hello. <laughs> uh, right then, um, I better um, get to work. <laughs> yes. And, uh, and get you lot in line. <laughs> Ooh! Who does he think he is? Telling us what to do. And what not to do. <laughs> Poor Dan didn't know the troublesome truck had its brakes on. It made it very hard to pull. <laughs> but not all the trucks had their brakes on. <laughs> oh, you troublesome trucks are so... You're so well, um... Oh, what I mean is... <laughs> need their parts. Sorry, Mavis. I just don't feel my usual self today. Maybe you're missing your best friend, Dan. Oh? Of course you are. But just think, the sooner I'm repaired and get back to the quarry, the sooner Dan can come back to work with you. <gasps> you're right, Mavis. Back in a tick with those parts. <laughs> You've got to be firmer with those trucks, Dan. Take a stand. Show them who's boss. Um, is that how Mavis does it? Oh, yes. 
She could be quite determined, you know. Come on, Den. You're a big diesel engine. Be brave. Take a deep breath, Den. You can do this. <sighs> right. I'm going in. <laughs> Like I'm gonna win again, Caitlin. <laughs> the race is on! Wow, Caitlin, this is fast! Fast? This isn't fast. But, well, you're a bit heavier than my coaches. Uh, heavier? No offense, Emily, but you are a great big steam engine. <laughs> like me! It wasn't long before fast, strong Caitlin had arrived at the Steamworks with poor, broken-down Emily. Emily was very impressed by Caitlin. <laughs> that was great, Caitlin. You're amazing. <laughs> amazing? Not really. Just built for speed, that's all. She's so fast, Victor. It was incredible. She must be the best engine ever. Honestly, Emily. Being fast isn't everything. I know, but Caitlin looks amazing, too. Her shape is so sleek and smooth. That's just the streamlining. Underneath all that, Caitlin's just a steam engine, like the rest of us. Can't the engineers do something to change my shape, Victor? Why would you want to do that? You're a great engine, Emily, just the way you are. A few days later, Emily was back at work on the main line again. Hello, Emily. Hi, Caitlin. Wow, you look as good as new. Did you get repainted? Just a touch-up. But no matter what they do, I'll never be as amazing as you. What nonsense. You're a brilliant engine. And you get to pull all sorts of trains, whereas I almost always pull passengers. I wouldn't mind a bit more variety from time to time. <laughs> Take care now! Hello, Emily! Emily? What's the matter? Oh, Caitlin is better than me at everything. Everything? She can't be better than you at everything. But she is, Thomas. She really, really is. Don't be silly, Emily. Be proud of yourself. Lift your shovel high and say, I'm a very special engine and there's no other like me! But I don't have a shovel. <laughs> and Caitlin is better than me at everything. You see how fast I am? Huh? You see how fast I... I am? Oh, where did that big engine go? He was supposed to be watching me. Big engine? Oh, you mean Gordon. He's about to pull the express. Hey, wait! Wait! Express coming through! Hey, wait! Wait! You were supposed to be watching me! Philip! Stop! Your signal is red! <laughs> Whoa, Philip, that was close. Ha, I know. I could have caught up with him if it wasn't for that signal. Gordon's very fast, Philip. And I'm very fast, too. <laughs> well, Gordon will be back again later if you really want to show him how fast you are. 
Philip couldn't wait for Gordon to come back. He kept coming into the station to check the time on the big clock. was so excited to see Gordon that he rushed straight out into Natford Junction Wait, without no. thinking. Hello? Big engine! Hello? Uh-oh. What did I tell you about getting in the way? You nearly caused a terrible accident. Sorry, big engine. Oh, I mean, Gordon. But why didn't you watch me? You went away when I was trying to show you how fast I could... Philip! Now, Philip, I know you're new here, but if you want to work on my railway, you must learn to work safely and obey all the rules. <laughs> I couldn't have put it better myself, sir. Hmm... I'm sorry, sir. I didn't mean to cause any trouble. I'll be careful from now on. I promise. 